I knew it. I knew it was you, Pat. I knew you sent me that. This, this, you knew you sent me this. So cool, very clever. G'day, you lot. Where to begin? Obviously, you're right. We're not the best at keeping in touch. Maybe with this, we'll have some kind of incentive or peer pressure, at the very least. And it's nothing like having two brothers to push you to doing things that you're supposed to be studying anyway, when they're both engineers. I wrote down in my handy dandy to-do list that I've been using, which merits probably a whole nother video, what I think about this project. Could we have themes? Each week, maybe we all put out a video a week, or maybe once person gets once a week, so then they can talk about more things, or like over the space. So then, for example, I'd be this week, then you'd be the week after, and then Kieran will get the following week. So we're only putting out a video a month, but in total we're covering a whole month with each of us saying something, and then we get one extra week to, I don't know, showcase some project in greater detail or something like that. I just don't want to rush into it too quickly with expecting us to come up with one a week. Although it may be possible. Don't know, I've got holidays coming up. We could show where we're living, or what we're studying, or where we're working. No, probably doesn't apply. <laughs> Pretty much what's been keeping me up all this week, I've got a few different projects and I'll just introduce them now and then we can explore them in future episodes. Well, I'm episoding my brother, the Bearport Housing Cooperative that I've just founded, I guess. We have our first strategic meeting at Lentils Anything, the pay what you want vegan restaurant in Footscray next Thursday. I've got Bear Brass, a project I'm working to combine music with volunteering. Loosely, I'll give you more on that later. Last couple of weeks of university for the semester, which involves Indigenous Studies Production Project, which is a transmedia production. Uh, I'm also doing a research project on originality in film, and finally a global languages course. I think my final essay is going to be on the social... Uh, how inherent emotion is in Spanish, or rather just how different languages are able to communicate very different things and there's no simple translation. So that's been taking up most of my time. I think this is a brilliant idea. I don't want to talk all day and I don't want to fill this video with everything, but, oh, and the other thing I've been working on is uh, AIM, the Australian Indigenous Mentoring Experience. It's a program where I go and help, basically go and help Indigenous high school kids uh, with their homework. So I wanted to get this video to before you go to Cuba because obviously in Cuba there's limited internet. I've been back for two months now. I really miss it a lot. Um, and not just because winter's coming now in Melbourne, but so many reasons, which I'll have to explain in another video. I hope you do get to meet all my friends there, at least in Havana, the ones who are there. If not, try and get to Santiago on the other side of the island. Uh, but that's all from me for now. Toodaloo. I've got, I can control the camera on my smartphone. Jealous?